Hello everyone, it's Lurgs here. Welcome to my channel. I'm here to save you time and money. And today, it's how to insert pictures into a table in a Word document. First of all, let's open up Word. And I'm just going to change the orientation to landscape. And then change it to narrow margins. And then go to insert table. You can insert a custom table, but you can just select one of these options here. As I've got six pictures to import. Whilst I'm doing that, there's a link above now about how to start a new page in a Word document really easily. Now to get these to the size that you want, you just hold the left button down on your mouse and then put it over one of the lines and just drag it to where you want it. So literally just hold the mouse button down and just drag it. Now it might go to a second page, so I'm just going to fiddle about with it until I'm happy with the results. Whilst I'm doing that, there's a link above now about how to have portrait and landscape pages in the same Word document really handy feature right now put the cursor in the first box that you want to insert the picture in then at the top on the menu bar click on insert and then click on picture i'm just going to go to a folder on my computer and the first one is me doing a bit of time travel not likely to ever lift a world cup but you never know and then what you can do with this is you can just hold the edges of the photo again by holding down the left button on your mouse and just dragging it to the exact size that you want. Now at the moment it will maintain the aspect ratio. So as you drag it in it will keep it in exactly the same aspect ratio. Now we can change this and I will show you that in a few moments. This is me meeting some of the ex-presidents of the United States of America. Let's just carry on. So insert another picture. This is me on the moon. This is one small step for man. Oh, that was a great couple of days, that was. One giant leap for mankind. Whilst I'm doing this, there's a link above now about how to take a screenshot in Windows 10. Again, you can just hold the mouse button down and just drag the photo to the size that you want. And I best put in a picture of my wife because she's looking absolutely gorgeous and that is why I married her and also she is lovely and there's another picture of my wife before she was my wife she never watches my YouTube videos but if she does and you are watching I love you very very much and thanks for putting up with me for so long <laughs> okay so if you go up to the top right hand corner and click on size you've got this tick in the box called lock aspect ratio so untick that and that allows you to drag the photo left and right up and down to the exact size that you want it whilst i'm doing that there's a link above now about how to print multiple pictures on one page in windows 10 the easy way so as you can see by dragging these photos unticking that aspect ratio just gives you a lot more freedom to be able to get them exactly in those boxes once you're happy with that then you can put some nice borders on your pictures there's lots of different ones as soon as you click on a picture it brings up the picture tools at the top and you can just select any of these borders i like the feathering on the outside version so i'm just going to do that on all six pictures So just click each one and then select that at the top in the picture tools and there's a link above now about how to transfer everything from your old iphone to a brand new iphone it's definitely worth checking that out if you're upgrading your iphone and then finally at the end you can actually put a board around the table But this looks a bit garish, so I'm just going to leave it as it is. If you would like more videos on how to save you time and money, then please press the subscribe button down here. I really do appreciate you visiting my channel, everyone. If you'd like to select any other videos around here, that would be really cool. And be sure to hit that bell notification tab. Yeah.